Today on the PC Machine Tech Help Show, I'm going to show you a free piece of software called Smart Defrag, which is actually used to replace your Windows defragmentation software. For those of you who don't know what that is, it actually speeds up your hard drive access speeds by taking files that are chopped up all over the place and puts them in a nice, organized way. Another nice thing about Smart Defrag is it knows what files you use most often, so it can optimize it the best. So enjoy! As always, you can download Smart Defrag from my website at pcmachina.com slash downloads, or you can Google it if you'd like. In the download section, of course, I will leave a link in the sidebar, but you just select the Smart Defrag option and download it, and we'll go ahead and get started. Now, after you've downloaded it, just go to the location you downloaded it to your hard drive and select it to open it. And then, of course, you want to select Run, and the installation wizard will start. Just click Next, and then, of course, you have to read and accept the agreement. This is freeware software, so it's free for personal use, not commercial use. Select Next. Of course, select your folder and Next, Next, and if you want to create a desktop icon, I'll go ahead and create one. And now, here's one of the kind of pet peeves I have, but you do have to install the IOBit toolbar. We're going to uncheck the set, set search by default, and uh, we're going to uncheck those, but we will uninstall the toolbar right after. After installing this, select next and select install. Now of course after the installation is complete you will have a desktop icon on your desktop for smart defrag but before we do that we're going to go start and control panel we're going to uninstall that toolbar select add or remove programs once your program list comes up just scroll down until you see iobit toolbar and then select remove and then of course you need to perform the uninstall just click finish and that's all there is to it. Now that we've gotten that out of the way, just double click on the icon on your desktop to start Smart Defrag. Now by default this will run in the background as Auto Defrag. You can select this and uncheck this because I don't like things running in my background. They do use up system resources. What I'm going to do is go to Defrag now and the great thing about this software is you can analyze your hard drive. So then you just select the Analyze button. After the analysis is complete, you'll be greeted with the number of files that require defragmentation, and this is horribly sad. My hard drive is completely and ridiculously fragmented. It'll give you a suggestion as to what to do. It'll tell me defrag only, so then I'll close that. Go back up here to let me select my option. Of course, I'm going to do defrag only, and that'll actually defragment my hard drive, but it will not optimize it. After the defrag only is complete, then it will I will do an analyze, and it'll tell me whether to do a fast optimize at that point. Uh, the deep optimize does a combination of the two, but fast optimize actually moves your files to the central pin, your most frequently used files to the central pin of your hard drive, which improves your disk access speeds. So there's two features of this software, the defrag only and the fast optimize, that actually help speed up your disk access speeds, which can speed up your computer pretty significantly if you're as fragmented as I am. So I'm going to have to run this. Now, a great thing too is make sure you can, I mean, if you leave your computer on overnight, you can have a scheduled uh, defragmentation time that way it does it in the background your first defragmentation if you've never defragmented before might take a few hours and uh, just start it and walk away that's pretty much all there is to it so that's smart defrag I think you guys will really like this software it blows away the Windows defragmentation software built into Windows and uh, as always thanks for stopping by don't forget to leave comments and ratings and don't forget to subscribe and let me know what you think of smart defrag just leave it in the comments below thanks again